Hello, I'm going to do a Rubik's tutorial on which one of these cubes? This? 3x3x4? Three by three by nope. 3x3? Three three? Nope, already did that. 4x4? Four four. Uh, nope, don't know, I even know how to do it yet. 5x5? <laughs> five five. Nope. Mirror blocks? Maybe. How about something easy for you guys beginners at home? What I'm going to do, I'm going to teach you how to solve the 1 by 3 by 3 or the floppy cube um, you can buy these at dealextreme.com or you can well you can buy them a lot of places but I'm going to teach you how to solve it alright so what we're going to do scramble it up now there's only a couple things that you need to do in order to solve this. This is a very easy cube. Um, you have to know the appropriate um, orientation for a regular 3x3. For example, I'll, I'll be holding it like this like it has this as my up face. So this would be up, right, down, left, I mean, I'm sorry, left, right okay so we're going to begin and what you want to do first is you always want to solve the outer band first so in order to do that it's very easy just line them up okay this white piece needs to go there so you just put it directly under it and flip it up oh this one needs to go there so we just flip it up all right if you have this, or you have, I call it the two dots, so it's custom cubes, um, you have to do a simple algorithm, which is easy. All this is U, R, U, R, U, R. And then it will be solved. Um, another permutation that you'll get is this it's called the H looks like this now when you have the H the algorithm you must do is M which is oh yeah so I forgot to mention that M is what I'm adding to the regular Rubik's notation you move the middle slice up one so um, in order to do M you just gotta go okay this is the algorithm M U M you and I'll solve it. Um, that's actually really nifty. So, yeah, it's always good. Okay, now another, the other, the only other um, permutation that you have to do is this. Okay. This is called my bad. This is called the checkerboard. It it's gonna be like this on one side. Don't don't don't. Yeah. It doesn't matter about that. Now, there's two ways to do this. One way, which is my way, or actually it will be your way, is the slower way, which is just doing the two dots method over and over again. So it would be U, R, U, R, U, R. Then flipping it over, U, R, U, R, U, R. But if you're looking to do it, um, I guess, fast, um, R, U, R, U, R, Give me a second. Now, if it's like this, okay, it, there's a faster way to do it, um, which is I think is well better, is this. The algorithm is U R D U R D, and then after that, you're gonna do L. 
R U D. Now I'll solve it. It's a little bit faster. Um, that's about it. I'm gonna do one more, I think. Um, I guess. Um, this is a little bit different. Um, this is a little bit, this is for doing the outer band. This is from, this is if you have this, you just happen to pick it up and you get this. Um, a good algorithm you can do just to solve it real fast is to do U, R, U, R. Wait, I'm sorry, don't listen to that. Okay, um, a good algorithm to do it would be U, sorry, U, R, D, U, R, D. And that will solve it. So yeah, I hope it helped you solve it. Um, I really like this cube, it's pretty cool. Um, you can buy it at dealxtreme.com, or I think you can buy it from the Custom Cube Maker. Uh, just look up Custom Cubes. I think he has one that's available for sale. Um, they're not much. I think I bought mine for like three bucks. They're really cool. So, uh, uh, send me a private message for any questions or leave a comment. Um, ask me for any more tutorials of uh, the Mirror Cube. Um, I don't I actually don't know how to do it. I just got it today. So, yeah. Alright, peace, YouTube.